So I saw Lack visited your school with, yesterday. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was that? Yeah, yesterday. So, so with you guys being friends and um, you know, you guys have a great relationship even even back in the day to see y'all together a lot. Um, yeah, yeah. Huh. Um, Lack Cool is a fan too, and yeah, yeah. when uh, how was that? You know, when you just think about it, like, hey man, you know, it's 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 twenty years later. And one of my best friends is coming to recruit a guy at my school. Like, does it feel weird, or did, or, or do you ever felt like you would have saw each other in this role? Like, what what, yeah. what goes it's, through your mind when something like that happens? It's crazy because it's like it's, it's it's full circle because it's like right. you can remember, you know, being college kids and hanging out and playing ball and you know getting to the league and hanging out and you know playing ball and, and chopping it up, but never thinking. You gonna be a coach? Like I, don't, I ain't really think I was gonna be a high school head coach. <laughs> you ever thought he's gonna be a you know running back coach, associate head coach, or interim head coach? You know, right? You know, at Auburn. So it's like this is kind of you know when you when you really really put in perspective, it's like you're really just pouring back. Like he always said, serving these young men and helping them um, and, and doing something right that, that you that you love. I mean, you know, you're older, you don't play no more, but then able to coach and serve and give back. And, and, and chop it up with the kids the same way we were years ago. Um, it just kind of comes full circle. And I, and I was telling, you know, Coach Knox that he recruited me uh, to Auburn. Mm -hmm. and, and and I'm playing for him. And, you know, 20 or some years later, he's back at the school recruiting kids. I'm telling them stories about how he used to yell at me. And it's just, <laughs> and they telling him stories how I yell at them. Right. So it's, uh, yeah, man, it, it's, it's, it's really, uh, really a blessing to be able to still be able to stay in the game and do stuff and help kids. So um, the whole Cadillac situation, I'm super proud of him. It was great to see him, you know, on the sideline as the head coach, running up and down the field, you know, head coaching against Nick Saban, winning some games at Auburn, the game in Jordan here. You know, it was just um, a lot of a lot of good. And, and I'm glad he's still there and they kept him on to be able to continue to build off off what they did or what he did and, and, and brought the energy back to Auburn. So when Lack didn't get the full time position, did you sense any type of disappointment out of him and y'all in like in y'all conversations, or was it more so just like, hey dog, like what? Because one thing, one one thing I do know about Lack, and every time I see him, it's the same thing. He's so <coughs> even. Like people don't really realize they see the Lack jumping up and down on the sidelines, but man, Lack is so cool. Like you know what I mean? You you can yeah. be in a room with Lack for thirty minutes, he might say two words. Like, yeah, you know, he's just gonna peep the scene. So seeing that side of him was different. So did you did you sense any type of disappointment from him as cool as he is, or was it just the same old act? Just like, hey man, it is what it is. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I think initially he may have been said he was disappointed, like, you know, for a minute, I guess. But uh right. you know, they talk and you know, did some deals and negotiated some stuff, and you realize he would be there and still be able to help out and talk to Hugh and Hugh, you know kind of laid out the plan or whatnot. I think he felt like, you know, you know, the energy was still there to continue to help right. build this thing, get us back how we need to, you know, getting some players in there, obviously. Um right. for safety and just being Auburn man and, and and you know, lighting that that stadium up the way, you know, he had man. it. And, and never that, seen nothing like it. Never seen yeah, nothing like it, dog. And that's what I'm saying, man. In, in that vibe, in that environment, and back to, you know, obviously 2013 in the 2010 season, or right. you right. know, through, through the 2000s, obviously, we was there, you know, at school, it, 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 you know, you just had that vibe at all. You know, when you're playing George, when you're playing right. Bama, bless you, it's, it's, um, you want to get back to that. You know, and I think, you know, with you and, and having some of those guys on staff and continue to build a staff, it, it would be, uh, it'll be interesting and fun. And hopefully he can, you know, switch it up and turn it around with, you know, with the help of Coach Cadillac.